up everyone? I'm your female otaku and I hate mecha anime. If you've been around my channel for quite some time, then you know that there's quite a few genres out there that I just relatively don't touch, and that is mecha, military, and also straight up yaoi and yuri, or shonen ai and yuri, sh shoujo ai, whatever freaking, I don't know the difference between the two, but the one that's more sexual than the other. The reason why I don't like mech anime is because, to me, whenever I see just the two robots fighting, it just looks like a couple of toys going pew pew. It just seems silly to me. I don't understand how people can get into it. Which I said that to my one old coworker and you know what he said? You don't like mech anime. Yeah, no, I think it's stupid. Do you like Attack on Titan? Yeah, of course. Then you like mech anime. No, I don't. Titans are flesh mechas. No, they're not. <gasps> But anyway, I asked you guys on Twitter to recommend me some mech anime. Now just to be clear, I have seen a few that I do like, and that is Jibuo and Darling in the Franks. Code Geass I kind of forced myself to watch because that was a mix of not only mech, but also military, and like I said, I hate the military genre. And Darling in the Franks is barely a mech. You guys gave me a lot of wrecks, but I chose three of the most popular ones. Two of them being the most popular ones requested by you guys, and one of them being the most popular requested by my mutuals. So you're gonna watch your female otaku start Iron-Blooded Orphans, Gurren Lagann, and Bokurano. I've heard pretty good things about Iron-Blooded Orphans. I really don't know much of what it's about, but I've seen clips here and there, and I just remember everyone freaking out over season two when it aired. As for Gurren Lagann, I actually have seen the first eight episodes, but that was a solid six years ago, and I really don't remember it. I remember enjoying it, that's about it. <laughs> and for Bokurano, I, I don't know anything. I, I have no clue what it's about. With all that said, let's get started. Oh, also to be clear, uh, I'm not gonna show full footage. This is just gonna be a highlighted reel, so we can just cut to the good parts, you know? Olga. Stupid name. <coughs> oh, he kinda sexy. I heard the dub's pretty good for this, but I I'm only watching the sub. Ooh, he got a back. There's the Gundam. Yeah, I really don't know what separates Gundam from other mech series, because Gundam's just been going on forever, you know? Is there like a certain... I don't know, quirk about them that makes it stand out. Oh, wait, are they on Mars? Whoa. Oh, wait, this <laughs> beat slaps! Oh, first fight! Oh, yeah, they're just training. Oh my god, stop, no, he's cute! <laughs> Is it hungry for girls? <laughs> Eugene! Is he just biscuit? Ooh, don't look at me like that. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm trying not to say- I'm sorry. That's one way to spell Chris. Oh, we flying away. Oh god, that cape's so stupid. Ooh! Oh, that's weird! Oh! Oh, no! Oh, their backs! Oh! Oh, oh stop, I hate it! Oh, connects to the mech there. Oh. So is it kind of like Darling in the Franks, where they're, they're just like, born to be used as just piloting, piloting the mechs? And if you can't pilot a mech, you're useless. Obvious. Upcoming romance is obvious. Oh wow, she specifically chose you. Again, obvious romance is obvious. Oh my god, girl. Stop, it's probably the first boy you talk to. Jeez, that got me. Oh wait, 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 oh! Clear. What? Oh thank god, cover that shit up. I am looking respectfully. <laughs> It'd be like that sometimes. Oh, you, you, you're just gonna fight just like that? Oh, we're just gonna do it shirtless? Okay, okay. I thought he was gonna put on a tank top. Oh wait, is she a thicky? Oh, she got hips! <laughs> Shut up, boss. Oh, he's the commander. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Yo. That's a mobile suit, yep. That's the one that we saw earlier. Yay. Oh, they want to run away. Yeah, you deserve a better life. All right. Yeah! Oh, that's it? There's no way, that's it? Oh my god, no, stop. 
May I just say, I saw Man with a Mission in concert. Flames. That episode felt like two seconds. Though I will admit, the thing that kept me intrigued the most was the hot sexy man. <laughs> I don't mean to be annoying, but Jesus, there was a, I didn't expect any man service. Oh my God, they're just, they're just shirtless. But we do have an interesting story going on here. Um, even though it is a military, I did find it pretty interesting. And uh, typically I don't really understand what's going on with military anime. I'm usually pretty lost, but this was pretty easy to follow. The princess also seems super cool. Uh, the main protagonist, he's one of those typical like Kudere types. Uh, doesn't have much personality to him, but I can see him growing into something more, especially since it's clear that he does have a goal and that is to lead everyone to a better life. Uh, so I think this is gonna be pretty interesting and this is probably something I'm gonna stick with. Nice work, guys. Now we are going to watch episode one of Gurren Lagann. Again, I have seen the first episode, but that was a solid six years ago and I really don't remember it. All I remember is, uh, let's see, there's Yoko, Kamina, and Simon, and they're the main characters. Uh, they live underground and then Yoko busts through at some point and she has like that huge machine gun. That's really all I remember. I don't remember anything else that happens. Uh, and of course, you know, Pierce your drill through the heavens. That, that's literally it. So that we have a whole 25 minutes. So let's get a good reaction. Oh, what? Bro, what, what's going on, bro? Are the stars just exploded? Whoa, wait. Oh, wait, yeah, that's that's the, that's the shades that come in it wears. Oh, roll crits. Is it pronounced like Gurren Lagann or like Gurren Lagann? Dig a tunnel, dig, dig a tunnel. Dig a tunnel, dig, dig a tunnel. Dig a tunnel, dig, dig a tunnel, quick before the hyenas come. Um, y'all live underground. And ever since then, Trigger has continued to make Kamina the lookalikes. Freaking Tenga from Kiznaiver and Gallo from Prome. <laughs> Yo, I bet someone has tattoos like Kamina. <laughs> there we go. What? What? <laughs> Stop, coming out's cool. The best bro in anime. Oh, is his name pronounced Simone and not Simon? Stop, no, he's cool. Yo! What? Wait, my heart. Wait, like, my heart's touched right now. Oh, wait, stop. I wish I was the mole right now. Oh, oh, you like big and plump girls? Oh. Oh, oh. Yo, when is coming? I'm gonna get his glasses. Oh. Full Metal Alchemist. He did the thing! Hey, hey, there's the shades. Yo, stop, he's cool. Yo, he's there smiling, bro! <laughs> Yo! Yo! Wait, that's so cool. Oh, there she is. It's her time. Hey! Whoo! I mean, hey, if I could whistle, I'd do the same thing. <laughs> he pulled a Johnny Bravo just now. <laughs> Stop, thick thighs is amazing. I know this is like in the 2000s, but like, come on. Oh, girl, you, oh, that gotta hurt. Yo, I'm getting a lot of thigh shots and I'm very much appreciating it. I remember this, believe in me, believe in the me who believes in you. Wow, nice. They're gonna fall to their deaths any second now. Oh my gosh. Yo, good first episode, man. Hype. First episode. I have to finish this. I really do. This is just fun. How can you hate Kamina? You can't. Animation still holds up too. You know, I, I absolutely adore it. Yoko, still mad sexy. And Simon's also like super cool too. Or Simone, I don't know. I kind of just want to call him Simon. Is that okay? I'm sticking with this. It's done. Now I'm, I'm watching this, but we still need to watch Boku Rano. We got the whole choir singing. So these are middle schoolers. The game. Is this a survival game? Was that foreshadow? Is she about to die? A fourth grader? Dang, these are children's, bruh. 
Bro, what? What's wrong with you? That's your sister, bro. What's wrong with you? Not the flip phones. Is that a Boku no Hero reference? Dude, what the heck? What's up with these sick kids? Dude! Oh, so this is the whole cast of characters. Nah, I don't like this. Something's gonna happen. Oh yeah, let's go to the cave. We're a bunch of little kids. We're gonna go in the cave. Yo, they're about to get killed. So something's good. I don't like this. This is a psychological anime, isn't it? I love psychological. That's my favorite genre. No, don't look into the light, man. Don't follow it. Yo, they about to die. Yeah, it's still on, so they gotta be around. Oh, but bro, I don't think that's a homeless dude. Not the child lure. Oh no, he doesn't have a pedo stash. We're fine. Nah, I don't like that. <laughs> Now that you're on my place, you kids want to play game? Like, uh, I don't like it. Nah, stranger danger, kids. What? <laughs> what? What do you mean it sounds cool? It sounds like he's talking out of his ass. Well, is this all just a simulation? Oh yeah, let's try out the caveman's little game. Half of these guys are gonna die, I know it. I feel like you can just tell who's gonna die. You know, the more happy, lovable ones, they're all gonna die. Some of the assholes, you're gonna grow to like them, and then they'll just die. Oh, she, the little kid? Bait. That's bait right there. She's gonna be the first to die. Oh, now you're gonna tell him your age? Yo, this... <laughs> I hate this. Oh, no, he's gonna lie. Oh, yo, he totally lied. Yo, this reminds me of the tomb. Oh, yeah, let's not check on the kids that are out past curfew. They're just being kids, you know? Nah, what's this? Oh no. Oh no. This ain't a simulation. Oh brother. You gotta fight 15 of these? Is no one else seeing this? <laughs> can no one else feel this? Oh okay. Oh no, those are the kids. Okay, no, everyone can feel this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, yeah, where's your glasses? Yeah. Don't got the blue light? This is real? Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah. What? Oh, now you call the Pat curfew. This is your first time? Oh, so these guys are a little easier to beat. Unless it's gonna get harder with every level. Oh, they do? I hate that. Okay, so it's kind of like Akame got killed where they have the core and you have to find the core in order to destroy it. Oh, that was like really easy. I'm actually genuinely surprised. I thought this was gonna- that's all that's left to protect the earth? What? To be continued? Oh, that's it! That was short! Wow! Okay, guys. I found all these episodes to go by super quickly, which must mean I enjoyed them quite a bit. Why was that so easy? You know, with the previous two, we saw like, this whole grand battle and stuff, but they just got pushed like twice and then boom, that was it. They done killed it or the old man did. I'm so curious to find out what's gonna happen next. You guys definitely recommended some pretty good mechs, honestly. Coming from someone who hates mech anime, I actually enjoyed all Three of these. I thought the only one that I would like would be Gurren Lagann, um, since I have seen that one before, and I, I remember the feeling of liking it. But the other two, wow, this like really blew me away. I don't know, let me know if you guys want me to watch more. Maybe we can have like a series, not me really just watching the mech anime, but also trying out other genres that I don't like, like military anime. I don't know, leave a like and definitely comment. Don't forget to share this with your friends as well. I hate to be that guy, but the YouTube algorithm hates me. Also hit that bell for notifications. That certainly helps too. And I also want to give a very special shout out to Sarah Hogan and Yovani Herrera for donating to my Patreon. If you look a very special shout out in the next video, stream, or what have you, then please click on the Patreon link in the description to donate, as well as links to my social media. I'm your female otaku. Sayonara.